Yeah, I guess uh, two main overarching themes that differ a little bit from last year. Um, the rise of AI hacking, it's always been here, but the both in interest and programs is increased from prior years. And hardware hacking continues to grow. Um, and particularly on the bug crowd landscape, we've been doing more and more hardware engagements over the last year, and that's starting to reflect in reports like this um, as, a, as a growth point for the industry in general. Yeah, and when you say hardware, the IoT device kind of hardware or more? Yeah, I mean, the last year we've done everything from ATMs to printers, uh, routers. You know, it, it really depends on the format of the engagement. But um, yeah. there's, a, there's a pretty widespread under that umbrella and uh, it's reflecting throughout the report. It's also looking at how AI will contribute not only from the productivity increase, but also from the creativity increase. Um, it also quite clearly points out that AI is not only just a productivity improvement, but it's also a security threat. So uh, the report also looks into those different uh, aspects and areas, which is quite interesting considering the current la threat landscape in the world. I mean, personally, I'm just really interested in learning new things and seeing how things work. And I think that's fairly common around, you know, the, the sort of hacker community. So, uh, Bug bounties and hacking aside, just learning how this stuff works is pretty interesting to me. The the flow on from that is you kind of get a bit of a peek under the covers of how, how it looks and how it runs and gives you a better idea of how to maybe approach it from a security, uh, like an attack standpoint. Mm -hmm.